Welcome back, everybody. This is Strictly Money. It's time to go green on Strictly Money. Bioenergy firm Selena has joined forces with British Airways with the aim to establish Europe's first sustainable jet fuel plant here in our very own East London. The facility will produce low-carbon fuel, which is going to be powering part of BA's fleet from 2014. To run through the details, we're joined by Dr. Robert Dew, CEO of the Selena Group. Uh, uh, Dr. Du, thank you very much uh, for being with us. Um, talk us through what exactly Solena is, so what, what does the company do, and, and what, are, what are your future plans? Uh, what we are is we partner with Solena, uh, with British Airways, in order to take waste from the city of London and convert them into jet fuel uh, that would help British Airways meet the European trading scheme standards, which actually starts as of 2012. Not many people realize that the aviation industry has not actually been accounted for in terms of its emissions uh, until 2012, where all airlines are, are now having to meet the European standards in terms of um, its carbon footprint. Uh, utilizing biomass um, to produce jet fuel has been something that airlines has looked for many times. Unfortunately, uh, today fuel from biomass like bioethanol or biodiesel, for example, do not meet the airline specs because, as you know, when we fly on jet airlines, the temperature outside is minus 40, minus 50 degrees. Yeah and you need fuel and thermal stability of the fuel. So therefore, utilizing standard biofuel like biodiesel and bioethanol won't work. And they're looking for, therefore, a more stable fuel, which is a synthetic jet fuel. And today, synthetic jet fuel are made from coal, like in um, South Africa or in Germany, or from gas, like in Qatar. But both of those are fossil fuel-based jet fuel. So it does save, uh, some utilizing of petroleum, but it doesn't address the issue of carbon neutrality. And, and how big a percentage inroads do you have with BA, or how how you know how big a deal is this? How well, it's a major deal because uh, this is a project that would generate um, 80 million liters of fuel, um, and uh, out of that, 65% um, of these are jet quality. So. Uh, once the plant is producing by 2014, it would provide all of the fuel needed for city center, uh, London city center, as well as for Heathrow Airport. Dr. Du, thank you very much uh, for being with us and, and for explaining. Uh, Dr. Robert Du, the CEO of the Solar Group.